Alright, so say you want to make a ringtone. You're going to need these two apps. They're called Ringtone Maker and GarageBand. Now, there are a bunch of ringtone makers in the App Store, so I'll put both links to the applications in the description. Okay, so you have to open up Ringtone Maker, then click the huge plus button at the bottom. Now, there are a bunch of options of what you can do, but what I do is import the video because it's the easiest. All you have to do is screen record a sound from, like, YouTube or something that is over 30 seconds long. Alright, so what I did, I just grabbed the beat I had on my camera roll. Now, what you have to do is click Share, and then click Save to Files. And then it'll have its own little category you can put it in. You just gotta click Add to Ringtone Maker. Then you can switch over to GarageBand and go to Audio Recorder and go to Voice. From there, you click the Breaks button at the top left corner. Then you click the Plus button right under the Settings button in the right corner. Then go to Section A, and yours will start off at 8 bars, but you have to change it to 30 bars. And then you go all the way back and click the loop button and then go to files and then go to the right audio and place it all the way at the beginning of the section. Then here you can preview your ringtone. Then you go to the drop down menu and click my songs. Then hold down on the video, then click share, then click ringtone. And it might say that your ringtone length needs to be adjusted, but it's actually the correct length. So then after you click continue, you can name your ringtone and assign it to a contact. Now when you go to your settings and you go to your sounds, you'll be able to see your ringtones there.